Estimates of pi to one decimal place go back to at least 2000 BC, but it wasn't until the 3rd century BC that Archimedes calculated pi to two decimal places, 3.14. Over the next few centuries, this estimate was improved to seven decimal places, and this record stood for a long, long time. It was nearly an entire millennia later before the discovery of infinite power series would lead to new progress. This led to records occurring every few decades instead of centuries. This continued until 1949 when computers took over. From that point forward, the accuracy increased at an astounding rate. We now know pi to over 22 trillion digits. But I would like to go back to that millennial long gap. How was pi calculated so accurately so very long ago? I would like to discuss Zhu's ratio. Zhu Changzhu was a Chinese astronomer and mathematician. Over 1500 years ago, he used a polygon approximation to calculate pi. While this method wasn't new, he went further than anyone ever before by constructing a polygon with 24,576 sides. Even at 4K resolution, a polygon of this size could not be displayed on your screen. He also did all of this math without the convenient writing system that we use today. Instead, he did all of his calculations with counting rods. He used different arrangements of wooden sticks to represent the numbers up to 10 decimal places. By using this method, he was able to calculate pi between 3.1415926 and 3.1415927. In addition to his work with pi, Zhu discovered the duration of many different planetary years, the volume of a sphere, and successfully predicted four different solar eclipses. As always, thanks for watching.